He's like, hi, I look at the Pokemart. It's a convenience shop, so please visit us in uh, Gradient City. I know, I'll give you a sample. Here you go. He's not happy right now. He's like, you can't go through here. This is private property. Order came in. Will you take it? So here we have Great Order. Oh, still trying to figure out what the parcel is. And okay, say hi to Professor Oak for me. I uh, will do. Okay, right. an invention that, the Pokédex. It automatically records data on Pokémon you seen or caught. It's a high-tech encyclopedia. It kind of looks like a book if you ask me. Draven, Gary, take these with you. And yep, I got myself my Pokédex. I'll lend you one. <laughs> okay. All right, later, I'm, I'm flipping you off. God, I really don't like, I really don't like Gary. He's such a, well, you guys already know my opinion about this. What's up, guys? It's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Yellow Walkthrough right here on our Gym Leader Draven channel. Yes. Gym Leader Draven, this is number three right here, and yes, 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 it is my birthday today, guys. So, thank you guys for all the birthday compliments and all that stuff. Yes, I am kind of getting a little old right here by Pokemon years, but hey, guess what? I can still do this, I love playing this, and I'm, you know, you guys should be happy that I'm kind of doing like a small marathon here for you guys. Anywho, in our last episode, we did, what, our usual thing, be our, be Professor Oak's errand boy, you know, that kind of stuff. Grabbed a parcel, got ourselves a Pokédex right here, and, uh, well, let's see. Yeah, he still hates us. He really doesn't like us right now after Lou. He, 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 he has a grudge still held on uh, onto Gary. So, whew, I guess we're going to have to go up to Viridian City, you know, do a few things. I don't know, maybe, I don't know. Shoot. Battle some Pokémon, get some training in, uh, get this Pokémon ready because... You know, we want payback. We want payback against Gary. So, here we go against another Pidgey right here. Now, remember, guys, I am playing live right now, so that's the reason why I haven't uh, messed with any of the uh, the editing right here. Playing live, so, you know, we will be seeing some Pokemon battles here and there, and I may or may not be doing this purposely just to, eh, just to, just to get some Pokemon, uh, Pokemon battles on their way right here. So, here we have another Pokemon right here. Come on. Come on. Oh. I'm kind of, I was kind of hoping for a level 5 or whatnot. Let's go, Sparky. Let's go. Thundershock right here for another win. A level 2 Rattata, and this guy is still not happy. And that Tail Whip. You gotta love Tail Whip right here. What a, what a good way to start off this whole walkthrough than a loss, right? And a Pikachu that hates your guts just 24-7 right here. And here we have another Pokemon. What do we have? Pidgey. Level 4. Okay, so this is going to be some good experience points. Hopefully, another level gain. You know, feeling that, that, that good stuff right there. And Pidgey, say goodbye because it was a critical hit. No level of gains. Okay, alright. On to the next Pokemon. Again, I'm purposely doing this to train my Pikachu because... Remember, we lost! We lost our first battle! We lost! And Pikachu will not let that go, so... It, I can't call it Swolkachu, Monskachu, Beastkachu. Beastkachu or something. And there you go, level 7. It's alright, okay, alright. And do you like me now? Yeah, he still doesn't like me. He really doesn't like me. Even even though you grew a level, you jerk. <sighs> okay, well, level 7 is alright. And uh, here we are in Viridian City. As you guys probably already remember, we already visited the Pokemon Center and the Pokemart. Um, after giving Professor Oak his, uh, his parcel, you can actually go north, north of Viridian City right here. But before you do, this guy is like, ah, I've had my coffee now, I can, now I feel great! Sure, you can go through. I'm sorry, I'm sorry I was so rude to you. I see you're using a Pokédex. I'll show you how to catch a Pokémon as my apology. And, uh, well, here it goes. Now, if you guys remember in Pokémon Yellow and, or Pokémon Red and Blue, this only happened... This, this can happen every single time, and it actually worked for the uh, missing go uh, glitch. This right here is uh, pretty much Nintendo's response to that missing go uh, glitch right here. We're not allowed to use it anymore. But I did see a few a few, a few videos uh, that 
yeah, missing goes not completely gone now. As you can see, this guy's like, wow, I must must be losing my touch. I ran out of Pokeballs too. I have to go back to the Pokemart. Hmm. So after that, you can actually go north, straight to the Viridian Forest. Talk to this young lady right here. When I go to uh, when I go shop in uh, Pewter City, I have to take a, a winding trail into the Viridian Forest, which is the next place. And uh, well, we could have gone through here. But we don't have that cut technique, and uh, well, here's another place of interest, which is the Pokemon Gym of Radiant City. Here it is, Gym, Pokemon Gym. It doesn't say a name. We don't know who it is. Hmm. I wonder who it is. Who the Pokemon Gym leader is. And if we go right here, Gym doors are locked, and I, I didn't even press anything. This just does it by itself, and it just pushes me outside. You see that? I didn't even do anything by myself. I was gonna talk to that guy right there, but we'll talk to him a little later. Now, if you go in here, I believe it's like a Pokemon school. Talk to this young lady. Woo! I'm, I'm trying to memorize all my notes. Okay, and what about this kid with the wings? Sis says Pokemon will, well, will become team if you treat them uh, nicely. Well, I'm treating my Pokemon nicely. As you can see, this guy doesn't... He, yeah, he, he doesn't care. I, I, I don't care. Okay, whatever, Pikachu. And if you talk to this person, he's just like, Okay, be sure to read the blackboard carefully. And... Well, that's something very important. It describes the Pokemon statuses and change during battle. As you can see, it has five statuses. Not, not including uh, confusion. But here we have sleep. A Pokemon can attack if it's asleep. Pokemon will uh, stay asleep even after battles. Use Awakening to wake them up. Burn. A burn reduces power and speed. It also causes ongoing damage. Burns remain after battle. Use a burn heal to cure the burn. Now here we have the world famous poison. And it says, when poisoned, a Pokemon's health steadily drops. Poison lingers after battles. Use an antidote to cure the poison. And then the froze, the freeze, the first. If frozen, a Pokemon becomes totally immobile. It stays frozen even after the battle ends. Use Ice Heal to thaw out the Pokemon, which is pretty cool. And the world famous Paralysis. You know, that that one thing that keeps on hitting me every freaking time. Paralysis could make a Pokemon move misfire. Paralysis remains after battles. Use Paralysis Heal to treat it or to for treatment. Yeah, again, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be uh I'm gonna be paraphrasing a lot of these things right here. So that's enough of that. And uh let's see. Oh yes, now after you, you've given the, the parcel, you can actually buy some stuff right here. And luckily, Gary didn't even take any money from me after I lost him. So I'm just going to buy five Pokeballs right here because I'm going to be catching some Pokemon. Maybe two more uh, potions because, hell, why not? Not that. And then uh, antidotes. I'm going to go with three. I have a feeling that, you know, it's going to be fun. And paralysis and burn you. Maybe later. I don't think there's a Pikachu in the Viridian Forest, right? I don't think so. Okay, so, first things first. You can go east from Viridian City right here, and you can go to the... Well, you can go sh uh, check out the Pokemon League, but the place of interest is right here, this patch of grass right here. Because there are some Pokemon that I want to capture for my team. And let's see... Huh! Would you look at that? There's number one, Nidoran Male. So... Here's our very first Pokemon that we want to capture. First teammate and all that stuff. And yes, the critical hit. If I hit it one more time, it's just gonna it's just gonna fade. So here we go. Let's go with that Pokeball. Pokeball, go. That's right. Stay in that Pokeball. And there we go. There's our very first Pokemon of our team. So here we go. Let's check out that Pokedex uh, entry right here. Nidoran, the poison pin Pokemon. Its large ears are always kept upright. If it senses danger, it will attack with a poisonous sting. Huh, that's pretty cool, I guess. Do you want a nickname Pokemon? Or nickname Nidoran male? Might as well. So, I had this in mind. I kind of did have this in mind because back when I was playing Pokemon Yellow, I would always use either Primeape or Nidoran. And there was one move that always... They always stuck out. They always got me into, uh, or got me out of trouble, and got me into trouble. And that is the thrash move. So I'm gonna be nicknaming uh, Nidoran Male this right here. So Thrasher. Here we go. 
Thrash. Here we go. Thrasher. So there we go, guys. That is Pokemon number two. Pikachu, do you like me? Oh, he's happy about that. Yeah. All right. So let's check out our next Pokemon right here. Thrasher. Level four. Poison type Pokemon. Its strongest uh, attribute right now is its attack. Next, it's its speed, and its only attacks right now is tackle and leer. So we got a we got ways to go before we even get a very strong Pokemon out of this. But once it fully evolves, it is capable of. I don't know, just a lot of damage. Just so much damage, guys. And, uh, let's see, we got one more thing to do right here. We just need to... There's one more Pokemon here that I need to find, need to capture, so I can feel comfortable going into this uh, next gym. And, uh, it's not this, it's Nidoran Female. But, while we're at it, might as well just, you know, get some experience points, battle. No, might, might even just capture it, right? Yeah, you know what, I'm gonna capture this Pokemon. Because I need to... I'm also planning on completing the Pokédex too, guys, since I'm actually playing this on the on the 3DS, and I can trade Pokémon. So here we are, the next, you know, the next Pokémon on our team. It's Nidoran B, or not? She's not on our team specifically, but next Pokémon on our collection, and it's a mild-mannered Pokémon that does not like to fight. Beware! Its small horns secrete venom. Would you like to give this Pokémon a nickname? Uh. No. That's mainly for the Pokemon that we, you know, that are going to be on our team. So, that's another Pokemon that we capture. So, we have to find that next Pokemon right here. Come on. There it is! So, here you guys, here you guys go. Pokemon number three, that is Mankey. And I really do have to be careful with this guy right here because its defense is pretty low. And, well, I love that. I love that outcome right there. So, I'm just going to just throw this Pokeball because now you're paralyzed. You're paralyzed, Mankey. Oh! Okay. I know what to do here. I know what to do here. I gotta switch up Pokemon. Let's go, Thrasher. It's your time to shine. Alrighty. And that Scratch Attack will nearly beat my uh, my uh, Thrasher right here. And alrighty. Go with that Pokeball right there. Pokemon 101 right there, just like it says on the bottom. Pokemon 101 on how to capture Pokemon, and there we have it. Mankey has been captured, and uh, well, let's see our its Pokemon entry. Mankey, the pig monkey Pokemon, an agile Pokemon that lives on trees. It angers easily and will not hesitate to attack anything. So its nickname for this Pokemon right here. I wish it had more spaces. Let's see. Let's see if I can. Let's see if I can do this. Pig. Oh, it does. Pig. Pig Hammer. This is uh, coming off of uh, one of my favorite uh, bands. Is one of my favorite bands is uh, Nick names or you know album names. Uh, that is Static X. Wayne Static. May you rest in peace. This is for you right here. Pig Hammer. Okay, so we got we got a team here. And Pikachu's loving it. Okay. All right, Pikachu, you're loving me now. Okay. So before we do anything else, we're gonna have to heal up some Pokemon because uh, Pikachu's the only the only guy that can actually do anything right here. So before we do anything, let's just battle one more Pokemon. Just one more. Just one more. I just need one more. Okay. So let's go with that Thunder Shine. That's right. Oh God. Okay. That growl attack. I thought it was gonna be like tail whip. And say goodbye. Huh. Okay. So it didn't really uh, grow up and level. Hold on. Let me check. Let me check how much it needs. How much do you need, Pikachu? Oh wow. It needs a lot. Okay. So we're gonna have to do. We're gonna do. We're gonna have to do it the best we can. Cause I know for a fact Gary's EV is gonna be at like level nine or something. So what we're gonna do right now is gonna heal Pokemon change some Pokemon around and uh, you know that you guys know what I mean so here we are in the Pokemon Center Pikachu get in there with your teammates there we go one two three four five. Oh, I thought there was gonna be five never mind okay so fighting fit hope to see you again and here's the PC that everybody's been talking about right now you don't know whose PC it is it's someone's PC eventually you'll find out it's Bill but 
what we're gonna do right now is we're gonna deposit Nidoran female because she's not gonna be part of our team. Um, another thing about this whole walkthrough too is that I will be switching up eh, maybe one or two Pokemon. Um, in my original Pokemon Yellow walkthrough in my Draven Nexi 711 channel, you guys noticed that I used the three original or the three starting Pokemon. I'm not going to use all of them on this walkthrough just because you know it's been played out. I've already have a plan, a, a team plan, and not only that, since I'm using uh, the 3DS. This enables me to do just a little bit more, and yes, I will be bringing in a Gyarados because it, it's pretty much my mascot Pokemon. So, whew, okay, I have the tiger, eye of the mother loving tiger, eye of the mother loving tiger. I might as well. Uh, okay, all right, okay, I can do this. I can do this. All right, Pikachu, let's do this. So go eastward right here and here we have our good old buddy Gary hey Draven you going to the Pokemon League forget it you don't you probably don't even have any badges the the guard won't let you through by the way did your Pokemon get any stronger just a little bit maybe I just caught maybe one or two or three so here's battle number two with Gary and he does have two Pokemon and here he comes out with easy pickings Spearow so let's go Dang. Did not know Spearow was faster than me, but it is easy picking since it's a, a flying type Pokemon. And that Leer attack will not do me any good right now. So any attack right here. Okay, alright. So that that actually did good right there. And here he comes out with Eevee. So I'm going to go straight forward and attack this Eevee. It's at level 8. Just a little bit of revenge! Oh, sand attack, okay. So it's finally learning its uh, evasive attacks right here, and uh, alright. Oh god, it's that tail whip! Oh god! Okay, so what I gotta do, I'm not gonna risk it, I gotta switch it up. I'm gonna go to Thrasher right here. You know, half Thrasher a little, fight just a little bit right here, and that tackle attack would have done a lot of damage to my, uh, to my Pikachu if I hadn't done anything about it. But it's okay, it's alright. You know what, let's go with Leer. Oh Jesus. Okay. Well, there's always a first right there, so let's go, Sparky. Okay. Let's go. Thundershot. Come on. For the win. No. Ah, oh, Jesus. Come on. Come on, Sparky. Oh, God. Okay. Here we go. For revenge! Revenge has been served. And it goes to level 8. Giggity, giggity. <laughs> I don't like to cuss in this channel, guys. I'm trying to change it up, but hey, Gary, how does it feel to fail? Suck it. So he's like, oh, you just lucked out. And yes, I gained a little bit, you know, you know, a few, few dollars. I heard Pokemon League has many uh, tough trainers. I have to figure out how to get uh, past them. You should quit darling and get a move on. All right. All right, okay. Probably right. So we're one on one. And Pikachu, do you like me now? Oh, finally. Okay, you're finally smiling at me. Okay, thanks, Pikachu. Okay, so what we're gonna do right here, guys, is we're gonna stop. We're gonna stop our episode right here. We have some training to do. In the next episode, you guys will be seeing a little bit stronger Pokemon on my team. You know, just with extra moves and whatnot. So thank you guys for watching. I will see you guys in the fourth episode of my Pokemon Yellow walkthrough. See you guys. Thank mm -hmm. you.